Well done on last night, a great result for Rangers. How difficult is this week now when you have to get the balance between making sure you're focused on domestic matters against Motherwell, but also looking ahead to that Galatasaray game? Uh, we used to play like that in the last two years since I come here. So I don't say that it's easy, but as I said, we used to, used to play from European nights to domestic league, so it's fine. Sarah, uh, how are you all placed with you know juggling the kind of European and then straight back and into lunchtime kickoff on Sunday? Same as I said, we used to play like that last two years. There is no problem about that, so that's why we are in Rangers, and that's it. The result last week um, was a frustration. Um, does it say something about the pressure that you guys are under? That you know when you get a, a one setback like you did against Hibs, it, there seems to be quite a, you know, a, a fierce reaction from the supporters. Obviously, they are, they are very worried about what's at stake this season with Celtic going for ten in a row. Yes, that game we, we should win, of course, and uh, pressure is always exist. In Rangers, we spoke about that a lot of times, uh, and I know that uh, fans are disappointed. We are also, of course, but. Uh, it can't be always perfect, you know. Sometimes things like this happen, and that's it. We need to look uh, forward as we do win 4 0, and now look forward again to play Sunday and to try to win. Hi, Borna. Uh, Hi. You've had a couple of battles against um, Motherwell in your time at Rangers. How much would you expect from them on Sunday? As always, it's a tough uh, away game. Uh, I don't think that um, uh, position of Motherwell at the league table showed how good they are. I think that they are a better team than they are at the league at this point. So I expect a very tough game. As I said, we're going to try to win and that's it. With uh, the, the one-off ties with no crowds, uh, how does home advantage work? Is it as big as it normally is? Because obviously, had it been a full Ibrox, it would have been an amazing atmosphere. Uh, and the team showed last night going to Holland and winning 4-0. But is it still a bonus to be at Ibrox uh, to play Galatasaray? I think that it is bonus because we play at home. But uh, when you mention now the fans, the, that's something what I missed so much. And it's it's so different to play without fans. You know, when we start the season first few games, you think, OK, OK, but now it starts to be, how to say, very boring without fans because they always uh, push you. You know, the crowd energy, especially when we play at home, our home games. So honestly, I miss fans so much that I cannot explain. I think that everyone, everyone have same feeling. Well, uh, Gary McAllister was speaking very highly of Ryan Kent and the impact he's made so far this season. Uh, Ryan's playing uh, a more free role, going from one wing to the other. I just wonder what impact that has had on your game. Could you like to get up uh, to the far end of the pitch as well? When we talk about Raza, yeah, Raza play very well. Uh, from the start of the season, every game he's better and better. If you're talking about my position, that's what the co coach, that, that, that's what uh, Gaffa said. If I need to be high, I will be high, no problem. Uh, I like to play attacking uh, football, so I don't have problem with that. Of course, when we play Europa League games, that's changed a little bit, but uh, I don't have problem.